I'm so glad you're watching this video. That says you've learned that there are bees, mason or leafcutter bees, that nest in houses such as bee hotels. That's awesome. A long time ago, these bees used to nest in trees, old dead trees that nowadays we don't want in our yards. We've taken them down. And these bees are comfortably nesting in bee hotels. Now, cautionary point. Back when these bees were nesting here or there, the pests had a hard time moving from this point to that point. And in a bee hotel, the pests are able to move from one hole next to the other hole. And so over a period of years, you're not only raising bees, you're also raising pests. Ultimately, all the bees die. So what we'd like you to consider is once a year, you're managing your bees. In the fall, you're uh, taking probably half an hour of time and you're opening up reeds or wood trays that you can get to cocoons by simply opening them. You're able to sort the good guys from the bad guys and that's gonna help your bees thrive. So please consider moving away from houses that you can't pull the cocoons out from. So houses that have uh, glued in bamboo or drilled blocks of wood just wind up being bee cemeteries and move to something where you can harvest your cocoons. Thanks for considering.